What's good, y'all? So today we got a very special shave, and this is kind of the moment we've all been waiting for. I've been enabled by multiple uh, members in the wet shaving community, and as you can tell by the title, it is my first time using a straight. Um, yeah, so this is, I believe, a full hollow AJ Jordan, I believe is the brand name. And this is made in Sheffield. And I don't know anything about straights, so yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, I'll show you the scales here. Very, very nice. I'm just kidding, it's very basic, but I, I like it. It's a clean look. Uh, this is vintage, I believe it's around 150 years old. Um, yeah, so hit me up in the comments, guys. This might go very well, might go very bad. Um, yeah, I've never used a straight before, so that should be interesting. With the brush, we'll be going with Declaration B7, Peach. And for the soap, we'll be using Mal Grooming's Talbot V3 base, and the set is called Island in the Sun. And this is a fantastic performing soap. Um, I did get a pretty messed up uh, puck, like the lid is all banged up, it's cracked on the end here. Um, which I'm fine with, I don't really care. But um, I noticed CDB and Corey mentioned uh, both their tubs came in weird condition, so I thought I'd mention it. <sighs> Eucalyptus, very forward scent, very hard base, which I like. Now let me get into it because, let me load, start loading. Okay, cool, so we'll do 30 second load. I have no, no idea how long this, uh, video will go could be quick could be long i guess we'll find out this stuff lathers super easily so yeah so this is a collaboration with uh mal grooming and talbot shaving mal um i believe is responsible for the scent talbot is responsible for the soap base so it has been a healthy partnership between those two artisans for I believe quite some time now this is my first time acquiring this uh, from this company and I'm pleased with the results if I don't go into the scent too much it's because I'm distracted by the straight so to give you guys a little bit of a background I have roughly 10 years of Chevette experience but I hear it's a different ball game so we'll see how it goes. Today I used uh, hot water, not, not hot water, warm water to soak the brush to see if the lathering experience would be more enjoyable. Typically anything but cold water makes my skin a little bit red and irritated. So I thought warm water would be perfect. Let's try. I feel like you can smell the badger hair more when it's uh, not cold. I did notice that. You got almost a lather already. Um, yeah, so I did strop this bad boy and I don't know how to strop. <laughs> um, I did watch a video from Kai Triska. Thanks Kai. If you ever watch this, um, yeah, as you can see the strop there. Um, yeah, I was afraid I did like 30 laps. I was afraid I was going to roll the edge. No idea if I'm doing it right. All I did was try to follow his video as best as I could and, you know, pray that it worked out. As you guys could see though. It feels like anyone could lie to this beginner, whether you're a novice or a long time wet shaver. So, um, I'm not sure which best lather would be for the shave I'm doing, but what I do know is this is one of the slickest soaps I've ever used. So I thought, what better time to use it? Then with a straight. 
Give me a second, guys. I'm gonna clean up the lather a little bit. All right. Somehow it got in my mouth. <laughs> I don't know how you guys don't make a mess. Like, I make a mess. I try to be clean, but oh well. All right, so I had Max Sprecher um, uh, hone this edge. Yo, look how much of lather. I digress. Um, look how much, like, uh, yeah, I had him hone this edge and. Uh, yeah, apparently his edges are sharp as hell. I've never tried anyone else's edge but his till now. So I can't really compare his edge to anything else. So we'll see how it goes. Um, sorry about that, I got a phone call. So uh, where was I? I was about to start the first pass. Let's see how it goes. You know, I'm super nervous. I don't know why. <laughs> All right, I got this. Whew. Gonna go... Oh my god, that edge! Yo, oh, that's incredible, dude. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> that's for you, Corey. Um, alright, time to get serious. I'm sorry, I had to have a little edge gasm. Um wow, it's like feel it feels so weird to gauge the angle on this. Jesus, and like it's so long. How do you guys do this? Yeah, if I don't talk much, it's because I'm focusing. And apparently you're not supposed to rinse these off, right? I can't even see if there's hair. I'm gonna wipe it on a towel though. Oh, I can, I can see hair on the towel, cool. Um, not too much tugging. You guys think I can go a whole uh, straight shave without uh, cuts? Let's see. I'm gonna jinx myself. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't focus. I'm just so nervous. I don't know why. This is, I think, 11 sixteenths, whatever that means. Ah, that's tuggy. Is that normal? Or it's because I didn't uh, strop it well? Let me know. Ooh, that's close. Decent feedback here. Whew. Yeah, this feels kind of weird, man. Just, I'm not even used to the size. Like, this looks small to you guys, all you pros out there, but this is like huge for me. Like, this ain't no Max Brecker, but it's big as hell for me, you guys. Doug Bear, hit me up, man. Let me know what I'm doing wrong, what I'm doing right. All right, cool. Let's do the neck. This is the, the, the real challenge here. All right. Yo, I don't even, I'm sorry, guys. I don't know how to hold this right now. Like, how do I go down the middle? This doesn't feel comfortable. Do I go like this? Or do I go? <sighs> All right, just do it. That does not feel as comfortable as a DE. I'll tell you guys that right now. It is very sharp though. You could tell Max does not mess around. <laughs> It, it doesn't feel uncomfortable, it's just weird. Ooh. 
Ooh. I'm going super slow, guys, but I don't care, man. <laughs> I'm not getting cut. I'm not trying to. <laughs> Adam's apple's tough. I feel like if I had Kai Triska strop this, this thing would be like butter smooth. But I don't know, I did like 30 laps. I followed his video. I like, I kept the spine um, flat with the leather, whatever. Let's keep going. Might as well line myself up, right? <laughs> Hold on. I'm just using alum so I can stretch my skin better. That's close. Go at least with the green. But it's this is a different ball game than um, Chevette's, I'll tell you that, guys. Whoa, okay. Okay. This is so weird. Okay. Almost there with the first pass, guys. How do you not cut your ear with this? This thing is huge. <sighs> All right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's Max's edge or my stropping, but it doesn't feel that smooth on the skin. And I'm not really, I'm going at a steep angle. I, I think I am, I don't know. You guys can judge because you guys are watching me, but whatever, let's go into the, I don't even know how the against the green is going to go, but there's only one way to find out. All right, we got a crap ton of lather here. It doesn't look like a lot of lather, but... Once you build in the water, there you go. This could take a ton of water. And this knot is like massaging your face. Not the softest knot out there, but you could feel the hairs in the softest way. No idea how I'm going to go against the green or across, whatever. I don't know. Go back to my album. Okay, cool. All right, guys. How does DK do it? Because he has a beard. I got to watch. I got to go back and watch his videos again. I've seen countless of his videos, but like, I don't know. <laughs> it's like I forgot how to shave, dude. I don't know. I'm overthinking it. <sighs> this sucks, man. What are we at? Eight minutes? Oh, I forgot. I was like 10 minutes into the, before I cut out. I don't know. We'll see. I feel like this is too long for me to go against the grain without hitting my eye. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I'm good.
Okay, I'm just going to tilt the top then. All right, that felt good. Nice. All right. No blood yet, guys. I'm impressed, but this ain't gonna be the closest shave, so is it really impressive? I don't know, we'll see. All right, I'm gonna bend this over and then try it like that. It's skipping way too much. Like I'm going at a steep angle, guys, and it, it doesn't want to go. This is the famous Max's edge. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not gonna talk shit. <laughs> not like I'm sure his edge is incredible. I just I don't know how to shave, or I suck ass at stropping. All right, I can't get past the middle. Oh my god, what is going on? Sorry guys, this is really frustrating right now. <laughs> well, you know, watching you guys is one thing, doing it is another. It, it really is. I mean, is it BBS? Nope. <laughs> All right, let's try this. I think I need like a Camasori. I was never a fan of the scales getting in the way. Um. You guys make it look so easy. Oh my god. It's like literally tugging the whole time. I think I need to just stretch my skin out more because I might have cut off too much of this. Okay, I'm just going to keep this thin layer of lather, lather on my face, rub it on my hands, just a little bit, because I want the lather thin right now, so I can see. Alright, that's as thin as the lather is going to get right now, okay, still pretty slick. again i don't even know what pass i'm on i'm just cleaning up at this point i don't know we'll see all right you know what i might do i'll tell you guys in a second all right i got really thick hair um but yeah Like, it's just skipping like crazy right now. <sighs> Shit. Okay. So on the outer parts of my neck, it's easier to stretch the skin, and I'm able to get a smooth swipe across my skin. My skin. But, like, in the middle of the neck, it's really a challenge for me. There you go. Is this the money pass, guys? Ah, all right, I'm getting a cut. Uh, yeah, I got a cut. <laughs> 
Can't see it, but I can feel it. Hold on, give me a second, guys. What am I gonna do? I got a different idea. Little lather is just such a distraction for me right now. I have no, I don't have no idea how long we're into the video, but I'm gonna apply the uh, pre-shave serum because that adds a ton of slickness and it keeps it clear. Okay. Because it's not smooth at all right here. Yeah, here's the blood. I don't know if you guys can see that. <sighs> I'll at least shape myself up. Damn, this stuff is slick as hell. <sighs> I need a lot of help, guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. You know what I think it is? Because I got a lot of hair on that swipe just now. I think I'm just too afraid to like apply pressure with the blade. Like with the DE, you gotta apply no pressure and just let the weight of the razor do the work. But this stuff, this thing's pretty light. I don't know. Let me know in the comments, guys. If you're a straight razor shaver, it's time to hit me up with some uh, some some advice because this 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 little be red right here ah I think we're gonna throw in the towel here guys <laughs> till till uh, the next time I pick up a straight because uh this is not really an enjoyable experience right now um what can I finish a shave with? Where the frick is my razor? <sighs> I got the Wolfman out. Let's try this. Dude, I'm just... Yeah. Let's... Uh... I don't want to... Like, I could keep going. I just don't want to irritate my skin too much. You know? I'm not giving up, guys. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. So, 10 years of Chevette experience does not translate in any way <laughs> to uh, straight razor experience. I was kind of, I'm kind of hoping that it would a little bit. I did the skin stretching. I held it at different angles. It's uh, whatever, man. I'm just kind of bummed right now. Um, I'm not even gonna finish. I'm not. I'm just gonna finish the shave off camera. I'm not even gonna apply the post shave. Um, this is the splash I'll be using after I cut off the camera. But um, I'm just gonna finish this with the DE off camera, and then um, we'll see how we'll see how it goes next time for the the AJ Jordan. The old faithful um i probably did this razor a disservice this vintage it's probably seen many great shaves but um i got a lot of irritation on my neck right now and it's still um a lot of missing spots on my face um yeah so we'll give that a rest for now but uh sorry to drag on the video a bit uh thanks for watching guys i'll catch you guys in the next one